Hello everyone, this is Shorkar Taslim Afros, Lecturer Department of English and I welcome you all once again to my English online class. Dear students, patriotism, yes, patriotism is a virtue that inspire a citizen or push a person to do something good for his country. It is a quality of being patriotic and a person who has devotion to and vigorous support for his country is called patriotic. So dear student, true patriotism is only when one person do something without thinking his own. That means when a person do something for his country for the betterment of his country is called patriotic and it is tested it is tested different times at different crucial moment like war pandemic natural disaster and national crisis dear students a proverb is known to us cowards die many times before their death but the valiant test of death once Yes, dear students, in my today's class, I will talk about a valiant character. Can you guess? You are absolutely right, dear students. Today, we will learn about Pritilata Vaddeta, who had a patriotic gel. In our today's class, we will learn about Pritilata, her sacrifice for this country, for us, and which inspires every person to love her country or his country and dear students after finishing this topic we will practice mcq from this passage and sample question from this passage and one more important thing dear students when you are reading a passage you know what to do you have to read the whole passage minutely you have to underline the important line so that you can answer all this important or related answer from this topic so dear students I'm going to show you the whole passes and after MCQ 10 MCQ because as you know from our revised syllabus you will get now 10 MCQ and the total mark is 10 next you will get six question so now let's start dear students here you can see on the screen some related photographs all these photographs will help you to understand the gravity of this passage please see the photographs as you can see here Preeti Lata, Shurjo Shen, the surroundings and different time hot teams and the notorious saying all these are very important the notorious saying is dogs and Indians are not allowed it now dear students let's start the title of this lesson is they had dreams one Preeti Lata was born in Chattogram on 5th May 1911 she was a meritorious student at Dr. Kastugir Government Girls School in Chattogram and Eden College Dhaka she graduated in philosophy with distinction from Bethun College in Kolkata. Dear students, the information about her education. Now, in her college days, Preeti Lata was an activist in the anti-British movement. All through her life, she dreamed of two things. A society without gender discrimination and her motherland free from British colonial rule. Dear students, please give emphasis on this information. You may find a question from these lines. Now the rest part. So, she decided to fight against British rule. Soon after, Preeti Lata became the head teacher of Nandan Kanan Aparna Charan School in Chattogram. Gradually, she involved herself in Shurjushan's armed resistance movement. Dear students, another information about Shurjushan 
and Pritilata Vaddedar. Here you can see Shurjushan was a famous activist that means anti-British movement organizer and revolutionary activist in Chattogram area at that time. In 1932, Shurjushen planned an attack on the Pahartoli European Club. The club was well known for its notorious saying at its entrance, dogs and Indians not allowed it. Dear students, I have already shown you the photographs about this saying. Shurjushan assigned Pritilata to lead a team of 10 to 12 men to attack the club. The raid was successful, but Pritilata dressed as a man failed to get out of the club. She committed suicide by taking potassium cyanide to avoid arrest. She proved that women can work like men. She also proved that women to need it to be prepared to sacrifice their lives for the freedom from the British colonial rule. Her dream finally came true. The British rule came to an end in 1947 though she couldn't see it during her lifetime. Dear students, I hope you understand the passage. Now, I am going to tell you the summary, that means the overview of the passage. Prithilotha was a meritorious student and completed her study successfully. She became the head teacher of a school and received combat training to fight against British rule. She worked with Shurjo Shen and fought against the anti-British rule. She sacrificed her life for the sake of her country. She was a great warrior against the British rule. This is the summary of this passage. Now dear students, some vocabulary, some important word for you. As you can see on the screen, distinction. Distinction means division. Discrimination state of being more or less movement that means activity resistance that means interference and notorious that means infamous now more words for you colonial rule means rule by another country gradually which means slowly assign which means giving responsibility next activist a member of certain social or political group last one fight which means combat now dear students as i said multiple choice choose the correct answer from the alternatives remember all our sample question for you first one Pritilata was born in the dash. Option A. Early 20th century. B. Mid 20th century. C. Last decade of the 20th century. D. None of them. And you can see the correct answer. A. Early 20th century. Number 2. Pritilata received her higher education from Bangladesh, India, England, D. Nepal. And the correct answer is B. India. 3. Which of the following statements describe Pritilata best? Options are A. She thought of being a meritorious student. B. She aimed at becoming a teacher of repute. Then C. She cherished an intense hatred for British colonial rule. D. She only fell a victim of British colonial rule. And the answer is C. She cherished an intense hatred for British colonial rule. Now dear students, number four. To what parts of a speech does sign 
belong here. Number A, verb, B, adjective, C, noun, D, adverb. And you can see the correct answer is noun, C. Then number 5. Number 5. What compel Shurjishen to ascend Priti Lata with the task of attacking the Pahartuli European Club? A. The writing on the signboard at the entrance of the club revealed a clear comparison between Indians and dogs. B. The British rulers tortured the Indians ruthlessly. C. The British rulers allowed gender discrimination. Number D. The British rulers always treated Indians in an arrogant manner. And from the options, the correct answer is the writings on the signboard at the entrance of the club revealed a clear comparison between Indians and dogs. Now, number six, what is the passage about? A. Priti Lotta's career. B. Priti Lotta's percentage. C. Priti Lotta's attachment to Shurjushen. D. Priti Lotta's patriotic jail. Dear students, the correct answer is Priti Lotta's patriotic jail, which I have already mentioned at the beginning. Now, the word assign means provide material, give responsibility, C. Take duties, D. Allow sign. And the correct answer is B. Give responsibility. Now, dear students, number 8. What is potassium cyanide? A. A poison. B. A medicine. C. A drink. D. A gas. And the correct answer is A. A poison. 9. The word read in the passage is A or N. Adjective, verb, noun or adverb. The correct answer is noun. Number 10. The phrase come to an end means to break, to resume, C, to finish, D, to work. And the correct answer is to finish. Now, dear students, sample question. B, answer the following questions. That means you have to read the passes properly. These are the sample questions only. How did Preeti Lota show her performance as a student? The answer is, Preeti Lota showed her merit at her school and college education and she graduated with distinction. You have to mention the college, universities like this. Number two, what did Preeti Lota cherish in her mind? The answer is, Preeti Lota cherished to have a society without gender discrimination and her motherland without British colonial rule. The students, for getting the answer, you have to read the passes minutely. Now, another sample question. Number three, why did Preeti Lota involve herself in Shurjashan arm resistance movement? The answer is, Preeti Lota was an ardent follower of Shurjashan and the possessed the same feeling of hatred for British colonial rule. Remember this, dear student, these are only the sample. You have to write your own way. Number four, describe Preeti Lota's read to the Pahartuli European Club in two sentences. Answer, Preeti Lota lead a team of 10 to 12 members to attack the club. The raid was successful, but she failed to get out of the club. Now, number five. What did Preeti Lata prove? Preeti Lata's activity proved that women can work like men. They need to be prepared to sacrifice their lives at the time of society's demand. Dear students, remember, it doesn't matter whether a citizen is a male or female. Number six, what was the condition of Preeti Lata's motherland at that time? And the answer is, at that time, Preeti Lata's motherland was in the grip of British colonial rule. In addition, gender discrimination prevailed in her motherland to a greater extent. 
So dear students, I hope you understand our today's topic, Preeti Lata Vartheta. We have to learn from her. We have to understand the meaning. We have to inspire ourselves from this character. Dear students, now practice a lot from this passage and you have any kind of question, please ask your subject teacher. So dear students, that's all for today. See you later in my next class. Till then, Allah face.